Welcome to Tech Yard guys this is Saurav of here and today I am back with another video and in this video I will be showing you install how to install the Resurrection Remix ROM on your Redmi 3S or the 3S Prime make sure you are rooted and custom recovery is installed so currently I am using the MIUI 8 you can see that and although I am in the global beta phase that doesn't matter but I still don't know why Xiaomi isn't not is not providing us the global stable edition but that will come soon and I'm currently on marshmallow and just you need uh, two files one is the ROM file ROM zip another one is the ARM zip well uh, the open G apps ARM zip well guys there is a mistake that I've done earlier the open G apps ARM 64 is here but you actually need to install the open G apps ARM 64 edition and the download link will be in the description below make sure you check that you don't have to worry about that we tried to flash the ARM first the I mean the open G apps ARM edition but didn't work then we used the open G apps 64 edition I mean the ARM 64 version and it worked perfectly so guys I will be you know going to the recovery mode and make sure you have a custom recovery I would recommend TWRP because uh, I don't know that if where where CWM is available or not, TWRP is there for us and we will be using that and TWRP is pretty good for me. And uh, yes, we are here in Team Win Recovery Project version 3.0.2.0. So first we have to wipe uh, quite a few things. Well, Dalvik Cache, System, Data and Cache. Don't just select this four and we're good to go swipe to wipe and it's gonna take a few seconds and done well guys this wiping can take up to five minutes in your case but for us uh, the ROM installation was new so it didn't take a lot of time so I will be now you know flashing the resolution remix zip file so the download links of both the open G apps 64 I mean ARM64 and the Resurrection Remix ROM will be in the description below make sure you check that and it's gonna take 2 to 3 minutes more or less or even more than that well it's been done guys and the time has come now to wipe cache and Dalvik well it's done and I'm good to go to flash the open G apps ARM so you can see I'm using the ARM version well guys I'm again telling you it won't work it just won't work and you have to install the open G app 64 so I'm sorry for that but I actually thought it will work so, but it didn't work that doesn't matter I will give you the link in the description below make sure to check that so I'm again trying to you know it's not working so anyways I'm again wiping up quite a few of things I'm wiping up the Dalvik cache and the data. You don't have to do that. You just, you know, flash the ARM64 and you're good to go. Just reboot the system. And I'm keeping my phone in here. Sorry for that glitch, guys. But all you have to do is that install the ROM first. I mean, flash the zip, ROM zip first. Then flash the ARM64 G apps. Then you're good to go. You don't have to worry about it. And then just reboot. Well, I'm, it's, it's currently optimizing the apps and it's gonna take a bit of your time so I'm cutting all these scraps and it's finishing the boot and you can see we are back in the home screen well let me can tell you this ROM is still in the pre beta phase that we can you know tell as alpha phase so it's currently in alpha so a lot of bugs will be in there and you can see four Chinese apps um, I don't know how to you know read Chinese or I don't know how to do that anyways uh, just go to the recovery again I will be showing you to do some other things with this device because the video sucked I mean we actually sucked when we installed the open gf64 we're back into it team win recovery project and now I'm going to install the arm64 based G apps so here it is you can see the arm 64 g apps it's just to show you that the arm 64 g apps will work nothing else so here we are and i think it's been done 
guys it's done it's installing all the files so we are back again guys with the home screen other things are good and asking me for backup which I literally am not interested and play store is there all the G apps are in here that's a pretty good thing and it has a kernel auditor which means guys yes pre-rooted I believe well, still a lot of bugs I told you that this is the alpha page and I'm using the Geo 4G and it does use just the does use the Geo 4G. That's a good thing. But I don't know whether the apps will be working or not. Anyways, go to the about phone section. You can see Resurrection Remix version 5.7.0 and Redmi 3S and what is Marshmallow 6.0.1 and here is the Marshmallow. Pretty, pretty decent move still now. No lags, no bugs. But I would tell you that when I was using after this video. I was facing a lot of problems. I don't recommend you to go for this right at the moment. But if you wanna use a new kind of ROM, do use that and do like our video, guys. Please like if you want again to subscribe to our channel. More videos will be in the cards or in the description. Make sure to check that. Till then, bye. People have a great, great day. Hope to see you in my next video.